Actress Francoise Dorliac made a big impact in her time. What was the first movie you watched featuring her? She had a unique presence that made her stand out from others. What do you think sets her apart from her peers? Share your favorite memory or experience related to this classic actor below. We'll be sharing interesting facts about her in this video. Keep watching for more insights into her life and career. Your stories and memories are welcomed. In the world of movies, one actress stands out for her memorable performances, Francoise Dorliac. Born in 1942, she graced the silver screen with her talent, leaving a lasting impression on the film industry. She's notable for her ability to play different roles across various movie genres, which connected well with audiences. Her influence went beyond just acting. She impacted the film scene of her time. Francoise Dorliac proved herself as a dedicated performer through her roles in movies like The Soft Skin and The Young Girls of Rochefort, earning recognition and praise. Her legacy isn't just about the characters she played, but also her influence in an industry known for its complexities. She became a symbol of excellence, leaving a memorable mark on cinematic history. Her contributions, though sometimes overlooked, remain in the memories of those who love storytelling through film. In conclusion, Francoise Dorliac, with her captivating presence and versatile performances, is undoubtedly a figure worth celebrating. She navigated the acting world with grace and skill, leaving a lasting impact that continues to inspire. In the early 1960s, she became really famous, winning over audiences with her charm and talent, which inspired her younger sister to also get into movies. But then, something really tragic happened in nice France. In a sudden and unexpected moment, she got into a terrible car crash and lost her life. The car she had rented crashed and caught fire, taking her away from the world in a really sad twist of fate. Besides her own journey, Francoise Dorliac's memory is connected to her nieces and nephews Christian Vadim, Chiara Mastroini, and Delphine Cantelli, whom she loved a lot. They carry parts of her personality, her laughter, and her wisdom as a reminder of how much she meant to them. Her early death shows that life can be unpredictable and can take away dreams and ambitions, even for those about to become famous. Despite the tragedy, Francoise Dorliac's memory lives on a bright light in the history of movies. Her lasting impact on the industry goes beyond time, echoing through the films she was part of and the hearts she touched. Even though she left this world too soon, her spirit continues through the love of her family and the timeless beauty of her work. Born to Morris Dorliac and Renee Simonot, Francoise Dorliac, the daughter of a theater family, had a distinct presence in the film industry. In the early 1960s, she was engaged to actor Jean-Pierre Castle. However, her most notable collaboration was with her sister, Catherine Deneuve. Unlike Catherine's cool and mysterious demeanor, Francoise exuded a contrasting energy. Radiant and outgoing, she brought a sense of joy to her roles and life. Together, the siblings starred in three films, Les Ports Claquin, Male Hunt, and The Young Girls of Rochefort, with the latter being their most remembered work. The dynamics between the two sisters, each with their distinct personalities, added a unique dimension to their on-screen collaborations. Francoise's lively and effervescent presence left an impression on the audience, creating a memorable cinematic experience. Francoise Dorliac, the French actress, had a notable career in the film industry. In the early 1960s, she gained attention for her role in Les Podus, directed by Francois Truffaut. This role showcased her talent and versatility as an actress. However, it was her performance in the 1964 film Les Paraplies de Cherbourg that truly made her famous worldwide. Starring alongside Catherine Deneuve, the movie received widespread acclaim and earned Dorliac a nomination for the BAFTA Award for Best Foreign Actress. Following this success, she continued to impress audiences with her roles in films such as Male Companion and That Man from Rio, displaying her ability to portray a range of characters with depth and nuance. Tragically, her promising career was cut short when she died in a car accident at the age of 25. Despite her untimely death, her work as a talented actress lives on, leaving behind a body of work that continues to be celebrated by audiences and critics alike. The older sister of Catherine Deneuve and Sylvie Dorliac, and the younger half-sister of Daniel Clarion Tapu, was Francoise Dorliac. She grew up in a creative household and found her passion in acting. She quickly became known in the film industry. Throughout her career, she played memorable roles in different movies. With each performance, she showed her talent, holding the audience's attention on screen. Sadly, she died young in a car accident. However, her work continues to remind us of her contribution to films. She influenced her sisters, especially Catherine Deneuve, who also became successful actors. 
Although her time in the spotlight was short, her presence in film history remained strong. In a sad turn of events, Françoise Dorliac, a talented actress admired for her excellent acting skills, passed away suddenly at the age of 25. She had a promising career ahead of her, showcasing great talent on screen. However, her journey was tragically cut short in a car crash while driving from Paris to Nice. Her untimely passing on June 26, 1967, sent shockwaves through her fans and the film industry. Her absence left a gap, a strong reminder of how fragile life is. Despite her short time in the spotlight, she had already made a lasting impression with her performances. The echoes of her brilliance continue to be felt, with her fans cherishing the memories she created on screen. Her sudden departure serves as a somber lesson, reminding us all to value each moment and the precious gift of life. The impact she made is remembered by those who admired her, even though she may no longer appear on the silver screen. Her presence lingers as a source of inspiration for generations to come. Françoise Dorliac's story highlights the fleeting nature of existence, encouraging us to make the most of each day. In the world of movies, Françoise Dorliac's career was marked by a tragic incident. While filming Cul-de-sac in 1966, she faced a terrible accident. On her way back to the hotel after shooting, her car crashed into a pond, leading to her death at 25. Dorliac's promising career was cut short, leaving the film industry and her fans saddened. Though her time in the spotlight was short, her influence on French cinema was clear. The tragedy overshadowed the legacy she could have built. Her roles in movies like The Soft Skin and Young Girls of Rochefort showcased her talent. Dorliac's early death remains a sad part of movie history, leaving a gap in French cinema. In short, Françoise Dorliac's life ended tragically, leaving behind unfulfilled potential and a gap in the movie world. She is remembered for her talent and the impact she could have had. Françoise Dorliac, a talented French actress, tragically passed away at the age of 25. In 1967, while driving on a rainy night, she lost control of her car and met a fatal accident. Shockingly, her sister, Catherine Deneuve, who also had a successful acting career, was filming nearby when the accident happened and rushed to the scene. Despite efforts to save her, Françoise Dorliac succumbed to her injuries, leaving behind a promising career that ended abruptly. Known for her roles in films like The Soft Skin and Cul-de-Sac, she had established herself as a rising star in French cinema. Her untimely demise not only cut short her burgeoning career, but also left a void in the film industry. The incident remains a poignant moment in French cinema history, marking the loss of a talented actress whose potential was tragically curtailed. In the wake of her passing, tributes poured in from the film fraternity, acknowledging the talent that was extinguished too soon. Her work serves as a reminder of the fleeting nature of life and the unpredictability of destiny. In a tragic turn of events, Françoise Dorliac met an untimely demise at the young age of 25. While at the peak of her career, she perished in a car accident on June 26, 1967, shocking the world with the loss of such a promising talent. Despite her short life, Dorliac left a lasting impression on cinema with her performances celebrated for their depth and nuance. Her passing left an irreplaceable void in the film industry, cutting short what could have been a brilliant career. Nevertheless, her work continues to be remembered and appreciated by audiences and cinephiles alike serving as a reminder of the talent that was taken from us too soon. Françoise Dorliac, the talented French actress, met a tragic fate at the young age of 25. Despite her promising career, she became known for a devastating incident. While driving to Nice in June 1967, she lost control of her car and tragically passed away in a fiery car accident. This shocking event cut short the life of a promising actress who had shown great potential in the film industry. Despite the brevity of her career, she left a lasting impression on cinema, remembered not only for her talent, but also for the tragic circumstances of her untimely demise. In her relatively short career, she starred in several notable films, showcasing her acting abilities and versatility. One of her most memorable performances was in the film The Soft Skin, directed by Francois Truffaut, where she portrayed a character involved in a passionate affair. Her presence on screen captivated audiences and earned her critical acclaim. Despite her untimely death, her impact on film continues to be felt by enthusiasts and critics alike. Her work in cinema is remembered fondly, and her talent is celebrated to this day. Though her life was tragically cut short, she remains a significant figure in the history of French cinema, leaving behind a body of work that continues to be treasured by audiences around the world.